Hello, I'm Dershdi and I'm going to tell you why and how I got a PlayStation 3 in this episode of Dershdi Memories. So getting a next generation console is one of the biggest steps in any gamer's life. And so was the case with me. I was really happy with my PlayStation 2 and honestly it's a great console. But the main factors were my friends. My friends were playing PlayStation 3 and I was really curious to know how the online gaming is. So the online gaming was one of the most important factors for me to get a PlayStation 3. Another factor was obviously the games. Resident Evil 4 was really awesome so I assumed that Resident Evil 5 is going to be awesome. So I wanted to know how I'm going to get a Resident Evil 5. And Obviously, getting PlayStation 3 or Xbox 360 were the options. There are many games which were really appealing on PlayStation 3 way back in 2009 which made me buy a PlayStation 3 including Grand Theft Auto 4, uh, Little Big Planet, uh, Clue Zone, The Resistance, you name it, there were lots of games. And in my opinion, the exclusive games actually play a big role in buying a game console even now with xbox one and playstation 4 you are going to think about exclusives before buying the consoles so it was the case with me god of war 3 uncharted they were really appealing to me and not just because uh, they are really great looking games i mean xbox 360 exclusives are also great looking and they're really great but what i really want to say here is that if you are engaged in one franchise and if that franchise is on a particular console like Nintendo's Wii or you have PlayStation or Xbox you cannot just move away from that franchise if that franchise is really close to your heart for example you have God of War, Halo and Nintendo's Pokemon which is really famous so that's a really big decision maker in console buying. The next generation consoles at that time were obviously the 7th generation consoles Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3 and one of the biggest steps was having Steam like online store like the PlayStation Store and Xbox Live Marketplace. It really changed everything for gamers. Now you can actually buy games online anywhere around the globe. You can download them. You don't even need discs. You have hard disk drive inside your gaming console. And it really changed how you look at a gaming console. From being a console, it became a PC-like thing with hard disk drive, HD graphics, and achievements and consoles were becoming more kind of entertainment machines instead of just being for games you can watch blu-ray movies on playstation 3 you can watch dvd on both consoles xbox 360 and playstation 3 you have netflix twitch you can browse through your music you can browse through your photos and having patches having game fixed really helps us to actually make gaming better because in the past if your game on a PS2 or any other game console was broken there was no way to fix it you have to release a new version of your game and one of the best example is Devil May Cry 3 which had a huge difficulty curve and they released a special edition so that casual gamers and people who found it really hard can actually enjoy the game without rage quitting. Free online gaming was also one of the best things about PlayStation 3. I was able to buy Xbox Live but I think that there were more friends on PlayStation Network so I thought of going with PlayStation 3 instead of Xbox Live and I met a lot of great people on PlayStation Network and lots of them are now my best friends and I think that the PlayStation Network community being free way back in PlayStation 3 era it really encouraged more and more people to participate in online gaming. Factors for console choice which console your friends have, the exclusives you want, and which franchise you follow. Now, factors that make you want to buy a next generation console are obviously hardware improvements, additional features in your console, and how bigger the next generation games are. So, in the end, I think I'm a really happy gamer now that I have a PlayStation 3, and PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360 have changed console gaming forever. and it's a really good thing for gaming industry and for gamers. So what do you think? Why did you buy your PlayStation 3 or Xbox 360 or your PlayStation 4 or Xbox One? Please let us know in the comments below. And if you like my videos and want to watch more, please subscribe and check my playlist for more memories. This is Dodge D signing off. Thank you so much for watching.
This episode of Dirty Memories was requested by my friend Christian. Please check his channel out. He makes some of the best parodies for games and movies like Resident Evil and The Last of Us. Thank you for suggesting this topic, Christian.